Hi, my name is Michael Novello from visualpix.com. Welcome to 5 Minutes Photoshop. Here I present you fast and effective Photoshop effects and techniques in 5 minutes or less. Today I want to show you how you can create a background like this with these hexagonal shapes. And for this I created a new file with the black background. And I'm going to add a new layer, go to Filter, Render, Clouds. And then I'm going to filter again, filter gallery to texture and stained glass. And <coughs> my settings are cell size is 15, the border thickness 20, and the light intensity is 10. You should have something like that. Maybe if you have a bigger uh, sized image, you should lower the cell size or make it bigger or lower, whatever your, your image size is. Then I'm clicking OK. And then I'm going to filter, blur, Gaussian blur, and I'm going to blur this out with about five pixels or so, and click OK. And then I'm going to add a color adjustment, a color balance adjustment layer, and I'm dragging the sliders to the blues in the midtones and on the highlights as well, like this. And then I'm going to create the polygon shapes. For this, you go to the shape tool, here, size 6, and the fill color is white. And then just go in there and place some of these polygons here. I have done this before, so I'm going to delete this here again. And I'm going to copy my previous made group here, duplicate group, and I'm going to duplicate this into my image here, make them visible. And then I'm going to merge this together to have one solid layer here. Then I'm going to control click into the layer. I'm creating a new one. And with the gradient tool, with a rainbow colored gradient, I'm going to drag this from above to the bottom here. And then I'm going to set this to color like this. And I'm going to hide my original white layer. Oh, no, we can do with something else. We can uh, go on this layer and we set this to overlay. Now uh, I'm going to copy this layer, the gradient layer, one time. Ctrl J or by dragging the mouse. And I'm setting this to color this is as color as well, and I'm going to set this to about 40%, and this one here as well. And now I'm going to Alt, hold the Alt key down, and I drag this layer down, and then I'm going to filter, blur, Gaussian blur, and then I'm going to blur this a little bit, just yeah, with four or five pixels. And <coughs> as you can see, those blacks are too strong. And for this, I'm going back to my cloud layer here and go to filter, blur, Gaussian blur. And I'm going to blur this out a little bit more. Like, I like this, that's okay. Then we see the hexagonal shapes clearly and then we can put our text here like before i have done this before and i'm going to copy my text from the previous done image to my new image and i place the text here to about here it's okay and the effects on this text are pretty easy this uh, inner shadow Blend mode multiply, opacity of 50, and the size of 7 and distance of 3. And an inner glow with a blue color on normal blend mode, the opacity of about 70%, and the size of 6. And an outer glow with a white color, blend mode screen, and the size of 24. You can place whatever you want here, it's totally up to you. In this tutorial, it goes, it's all about just this background here. 
So, yeah, we are finished. This is the hexagonal shaped background. Thank you for watching my videos. Um, if you like my videos, you can subscribe to my channel right here in the middle. And my last two videos you can find here and here. And if you really like my videos, you can support me on patreon.com. Here's the link. And thanks again. And see you next time. Bye.